The third point that I want to make to you, you are always creating, always creating, always creating. 30,000 to 50,000 thoughts a day and you are always creating. What goes in your mind in the invisible comes out of your mouth and determines your reality. You are always creating. There is not a second of the day that goes by that is wasted unless the words you are using are wasting your own life and you're trying to blame it on somebody else. Always creating. Here's where it gets even more entertaining. Number one question I'm asked when I'm in the hospital. Any guesses? Yes! Thank you. That was like the quickest. You guys are sharp up here. How are you feeling? Who cares how I feel? Who cares how any of you feel? Love you, don't get me wrong, I'm gonna be there for you, but your feelings do not determine the power on your path to your purpose. Your feelings, I'm the first person to tell you, I appreciate that you have them, it's called being human, but your feelings do not stop you. Your feelings have nothing to do with the results you are trying to achieve, it's just your internal representation of your baggage and your excuses and what's holding you back and why you can't do the thing that everybody else can do. Your feelings don't mean. And some of you do not like that either, which is cool. That's your story, not mine. And it's interesting. So when I first, gosh, okay, so 32, I own that, proud of that, um, mainly because all my friends are dead. And having cystic fibrosis, has taught me that it doesn't matter if I feel good. How many of you guys like, I don't feel like going to the gym today? How many of you are still trying to lose the weight? <laughs> Your feelings don't matter if you can get up and go. 